All right, guys, today's video, um, kind of a trade recap I'm trying to get in the habit of doing, is actually on NNE, even though I'm showing you SMR here. Uh, da, 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 let me do this real quick. You can kind of see this was the opening candle. You could see the massive volume compared to yesterday, right? I'm just kind of zoomed in. Um, so SMR to me was almost immediately in play. If I switch to 60s, and let me pan out a little bit here. You can kind of see, right? A little cup and handle and breaking out today. So that put it on my radar and then my brain went to NNE, which is in the same space and um, has been strong lately. Let me show you the daily on that one. So NNE, I noticed yesterday's high was 1345. Now let me switch to five minute candles. Remember, SMR is the reason I started watching NNE. Sahil made a great call on NNE um, the other day. Might've been yesterday, I don't know. I get them all confused. Um, so I put this on everyone's radar and I noticed again, topped out at 1324 and yesterday's high again was 1345. Um, and then we got this intraday cup and handle. So when I saw SMR breaking out and continuing, um, I gave the 13 break, which is right where my cursor is 13 break ID. You kind of had an intraday cup and handle whole number inflection point with the earlier high and yesterday's high stacked above. So stacked catalyst on a recent high flyer in a space where another stock is breaking out. And this one was the lower float. Loved everything about it. Took the 13 break. Um, someone emailed me, and I don't know if, they, uh, if, if they're in chat now on voice, so I'm just gonna put it in this video. They asked how I sold, right? So I, saw, I started scaling out when it broke today's high. When, it break, when they start knocking down catalysts, I sell some, right? So sold some as it broke today's high. Sold some as it broke yesterday's high. And then, here's, here's my blunder, and every day I have one. So, I'm actually out a big chunk and I had a, what I would call runners left and I put my stop at right where I bought it, right at the whole number 13. So I am the schmuck that got stopped out my last shares right there. It did this flush and then it's been back up ever since. Um, my stop should have been below the whole number 13. I don't know what I was thinking. I had a decent trade, obviously could have been much better. Um, and now it's gone to 1440 or whatever. So uh, again, to recap, you had a stock in that space breaking out this was a recent high flyer we already knew that from the other day we traded it um, then you had the early high above and yesterday's high so we call that stacked catalyst and you had an intraday cup and handle and a whole number inflection point i loved everything about it which is why i was on the mic talking about this one it's my favorite setup of the day yes i handled it poorly but still made some money anyway any questions hit me up